It's a him, Mario. 3D All-Stars. God, yes. Stick the nostalgia right into my butt cheeks. Dude, I can't tell you how excited I am to play this on the Switch. It's me, Mario. Yes, it is you, Mario. Hello. Hi, I'm so ready to play. But first, let me grab that nose, boy. Yeah, there we go, there it is. Whoa, that's a lot of Marios. You know he's looking at that subscribe button. Bro, don't yawn when I'm trying to shill. Ah, oh, Peach looking beautiful as ever. Dun, 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 dun. Come on, lag two, let's get it. Hit that wide shot of the castle, bro. You know he's going to film school after this. Cinematic prodigy in the making. I'm birthed! Ha ha! Woohoo! I'm freaking home, dude. Sure, sure, sure. Uh huh, uh huh. Shut up. I know how to game. Been gaming since, like, the moment I was born. Oh my god! Bob on battlefield, baby! Look, if you had told a very younger me, that I could play Super Mario 64 for somewhat of a living? I mean, I would tell you to get out of there. I'd be too busy playing Super Mario 64 to listen to you. Okay, well, I thought I was being clever with my shortcuts, and yet I have just exploded a little bit. Listen to, listen to that jam. It is the best. I'm Super Mario, jump through the paintings, yeah. You can't hit me with your giant big balls. I'll jump over them and then I'll crush them all. This game, I want to like slam on Nintendo for making such a lame port, but dude, this game is so actually good that I don't even care. Bada boom, I'm gonna blow you up, you stupid idiot. My mustache is better than yours, damn right. I could teach you, but I'd have to charge, son. Come here. Kobe. Yeah, that one was for Kobe. Dun, gonna grab your ass without your consent. I love this video game! The nostalgia's hitting like so hard right now. It's hitting harder than I've ever been hit by anything in my life, including my father. Just kidding, he never did that, though he did teach me how to game. Explode. Good job, I will now take your heart. Persona 5, baby. That's right, it all comes back to Persona 5. I know I got a star, but I don't care about that. I'm going right back in to kick Koopa the Quick's dumb ass. Race me, fool. I want to destroy you at your own game. I'm out of here, bro. You can't stop me. I'm gone. I was gone like yesterday. Dude, look at me go. These long jumps are optimal. Oh, that's okay though. Optimal jumps, as I was saying. Do I need anything besides the Yahoo, dude? Look at this slow ass turtle, bro. Should have been a bunny, man. Maybe you could have not lost. I'm thinking that next I want to go to the Fortress of the Womp, cause I like that level. And that's where I'm going now. The level of control feels so good. I love this game. I'll jump over piranhas and run over a block and then cross a bridge and do a jump. Oh yeah. You're gonna have a hard time getting me to stop singing when I'm playing this game, dude. It just has way too many bangers. Plus the nostalgia is so delicious. Well, you want to fight about it? There's something you didn't know about my boy Mario. That's not it. Try again. Dude, Mario got the hops. I cleared that man in one fell swoop. He'll be needing to get better if he wants to crush the M. This game is so dope. I'll be like an 80 year old crusty man and I'll still be enjoying me some Mario 64. Oh, good old Mario 64. Shit, I bumped my freaking head. That's not very gamer. Intense rug burn. Mario's nipples are destroyed. Mamma Mia, am I right, gamers? Like, comment, subscribe if that's ever happened to you in your entire lifetime. But it's alright if I cheat on this one, so, uh, there you go. In case you weren't gamer enough to know that you can just say fuck you to walls. Come here, you dumb bird. Let me take you back to your frickin' mother. I've got your child! No, 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 no. Don't, don't try to kill yourself. You're too young for that. Sup, dog? Here's your baby. Maybe next time don't leave him on top of a mountain, you absolute buffoon of a parent. Every single sound in this video game gives me a nostalgia boner, and I'm only 20% sorry about it. I'm aiming for the tree. I'm aiming and I'm gaming. Crap. It hurts, but not enough to keep me down. Let's do it again. Ah, there we go. The perfect shot. Let's get a star. I pounded it with my ass.
guess. Bro, Bowser, if I were you right now, I'd be sweating. Oh, it's Peach. Wait a minute. That's Bowser. That's fine. That's fine. I was going too fast. Lessons have been learned. Come on, man. I got greedy. Third time's the charm, though. Maybe I'll learn my lesson and take it a little bit slow this time. Doubtful, but, you know, stranger things have happened. Boom. I love this song, too. It's a banger. Yes, it is. Oh, my God. The movement is so crisp. Punch a Goomba. That's what life is all about. Professional gamer moment, ladies and gentlemen. Do I even need to say it? This tune is also quite a banger. Bye -bye. That hurts my feelings. So long, gay Bowser. Well, that's not nearly as satisfying. I killed him and now he's a key. Sucks to be him. <laughs> this is a good video game. Now grab that square doorknob. <laughs> We're getting polygonal up in here, bro. Don't make me kick you in the face. Come on, man. Come on, man. Play it cool. Play it cool. Play it cool. Play it cool. Have some tact. Get served, son. You never should have stepped to me. Let's just grab this star really quick because the order of things does not matter whatsoever in this video game, which truly is one of its greatest strengths. This game's so easy to play. I love this game. I'm having so much fun. I disagree, but that's all right, because I fell into money, which also heals me. Thanks once again, money. Man, here's a fun fact about this thing. It's when I was a child, it used to terrify me because look at its eyes. Ew. Uh, do I want to get the metal cap first or do I want to get the star first? I choose the star. Instant gratification, that sort of thing. Taking unnecessary risks is the game. Red Mario is sometimes my name. If you think I have time to wait for an elevator, you're very incorrect. I tell you, being invincible is one thing, but being invincible with a banger of a song like this as your theme music, that hits different, dare I say. Get closer so I can kick you in the head. Okay, almost missed it and went right into the quicksand. That would not have been very gamer. I need to get out of here. I need to get out of the sand. Okay, really thought I was gonna die there. Stop tornadoing me. I wanna be free. Nothing personal, kid. Who walk here? It's a me, Fabrizio. Now I have to fight some hands. I have to throw hands with giant hands. Excuse me, physics. I don't really need to pay attention to you because I'm on a turtle shell. That's how video games work. You see, I could do Bully the Bullies, or I could get my ass burnt alternatively and then jump into the volcano. Or I could die. That's always a possibility too. Luckily, your boy don't miss thrice. That's the end of my statement. Ow. Oh, okay. I thought I almost bunked that one up, but I didn't, which means another star for Mario. Why go into a volcano willingly? I hear you asking yourselves. And there's a very simple explanation. Mario's trying to get him some. I love how raw everything is in this game. Like, look at that elevator, dude. It's just a rectangle. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh, I gamed it. I gamed it hard. Yes, 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 yes. That's what I'm talking about, boy. Let's go, dude. Let's salvage that. It was almost terrible, and then I won. Son of a bitch, Mips. Get back here. I'll get down there the easy way. I have a couple regrets. Nail that one. Quick triple jump. Get my asshole burned. That's all right. I've been meaning to take care of a couple of hairs back there anyway. Fall Guys has taught me how to handle seesaws, so I know that I need to balance it in order to find success. I've made mistakes. Oh, wow. I'm all right. Okay, cutting it close, even for Mario 64 standards. No, <laughs> why? Why does this have to be so stressful? Why can't it just be an easy jaunt for red coins? I got the coins, I got the vanish cap. I did all the things that I set out to do. Or in other words, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Bada bing, bada boom, that's all the caps, son. I hope you enjoyed my Mario 64 tutorial. Time to commit skydive. You can't avoid water levels forever. It had to be done sooner or later, okay? Besides, why would you want to when they sound so peaceful? Get out of there, bitch. Come chew on the spicy Italian ass. Come out of there, you terrifying beast. Ow. Get out of there right now. Get out of there right now or I'm gonna drown. On second thought, you stay in there. I'll just drown out here. I mean, I can't get much closer without hurting myself, so... Okay, well... Your hitbox is gigantic, isn't it? Please come out of your hole now. 
so I can get the star. Please come out of there, Mr. Eel. Please come out. Please come the hell out. I came out here to check something very important. Still blurry. All the nightmares, all the nightmares. I don't want to experience them. I did it. I killed all the smaller boos, so now I got the big boo. Look at how big he is, dude. He do be a bigger boo, though. Back at it again at Krispy Kreme. I mean, blah, blah, on Battlefield, whichever. It's basically the same place. Gather up them red coins, which always felt like such a daunting task back in the day. I don't know, probably because I had stupid pea brain and I couldn't remember where eight things were. But now it's just kind of like a baby tiny chore, you know? Collect thing coins is a fun task in this video game. Load the Italian. Anyway, Mario's Spider-Man, so deal with that information how you will. Be free, Bow Wow. I will have need of you in another universe. Friendly reminder that I'm having just the best time. Also, let me know if you're having a good time watching, because I'll continue making these. I'll finish the whole game. I'll finish all three games. I love these games. So leave your feedback in the comments, please. Side flip, wall jump. Yeah, there we go. The gamer way, lads. Certified fresh gamer over here. All right, I think I'm gonna skip red coins for now, but I am gonna get blast away the wall. It's just hurling myself at a large chunk of concrete out of a cannon. When has that ever not worked out for anyone? Jump into that jelly. It's peaceful music gives me lots of time to reflect. And in my tranquil reflection time, I've realized the following. Water levels still suck ass. Mario waits for no elevator, man. Even when the alternative is burning lava. Elevators are for chumps, I wall jump up them. Platforms are for chumps, I long jump over them. Hanging, swinging things are for chumps, I long jump over them. Oh no, the jumps were not timed perfectly and I paid the price. It's one of the greatest sound effects in all of gaming. It's no wonder it's a meme that has staying power to this day, dude. Whoa, yeah, big jumps, man. Come on. I wait for no elevator. I already told you this. My movement. My movement, dude. My movement. It can't be stopped. Look at me go. Hell yeah. God, built like a pile of cinder blocks, my guy. Mm, gonna get you. There we go. I got you. Bye bye. Dude, I'm still so soft on the bye-bye. Consider this a draw, even though you blew me up and beat me again. Why is Bowser exactly like online gamers? I'll never not be mad about this. That is just the biggest injustice in all of Super Mario 64 history. Why would you take out the BLJ? What a difficult boss fight. It's incredible that I managed to complete it unscathed. Snowman's big head. I tell you, one of these days I'll jump into a painting and actually do the intended star. But not today, this time I'm gonna do into the igloo, cause I feel like it. I don't actually want that right now, so no thank you. Right now I want to go into the igloo. Hooray! Let me in, damn it. Don't look at me like that, Goomba. We all make mistakes. Your mistake was being a Goomba, now you're dead. Now I can travel through ice with the power of power. And with said power, I can grab my power star. So I could go to the snowman's big head, or I could hop up in here and do a little maze. There we go. Now we can just hop down here and continue not to do snowman's big head. That sounds gross now that I've said it out loud. Nothing says Super Mario 64 like punting a Goomba into absolute oblivion. I meant to punch him. I want my money back. Enemy spotted. <laughs> he goes so far. Oh, hey there, Koopa the Quick. Hit him with the triple oof. That's how you know I mean business. He probably shouldn't have approached me right there. Mario's got a frame one jab in this game. It's also enormous and deals a million knockback. Well, I guess I'm doing red coins because I didn't die right there. And I'm not going to do them again. Thanks, Monty Mole. Oh, yeah, there we go. Right on the mushroom tip. Alrighty, I don't really want to climb the mountain again, so instead I will talk to Fungus and get free star. That sounds like a plan. Punch with your fist, Mario, not your face. We talked about this, buddy. Stop doing that. You're freaking everyone out here, Mario. And the real wet, dry world was the power coin we subscribed to along the way. I need 30 more stars to complete the game, and I will do that in the next video. And then we'll be moving on to Sunshine. So let me know what you thought of this video, and subscribe before Baby Mario Baby gets ya. And remember, we're all baby. <laughs> Welcome back to Super.
Mario 64. I'm gonna go upstairs, and I'm gonna get the rest of the stars that I need. I go where the wind takes me. I am Super Mayor. He's trying to grab me, but he can't even get onto my level. The level of constantly being electrocuted. That's not really my problem, though, because I'm too rich in Power Star to give a heck. I don't want to be burned. That's not part of my game plan. My game plan is win and then profit, and anything else besides that is not invited into my game plan. The name of the star is called Shocking Arrow Lift. And it's shocking that they think I would even bother to use that when I can just use the long jump. The greatest bit of movement to ever exist in any Mario game ever. I thought I could make that jump. I should have known better. Ha ha! That's what my life is all about. alley -oop. There we go. Nice, safe, and sound. Not a problem. Uh, sir, I need to get up there. Uh, sir, you've thrown me the wrong way. Atta boy, that's what I'm talking about. Thanks for the help there, buddy. Uh, okay, so I need to touch this and then go down. And the fastest way down is gravity! I've been telling you guys for years, man. I got the mad skills. I'm gaming extraordinaire. Hello, sir, I'd like to blast myself out of industrial warfare items. Don't question my sanity, please. I've made my choice. That's not what I meant to do. I meant to do a long jump. What if you wanted to do a long jump, but the ground pound said, allow me to introduce myself. When I was but a wee lad, it took me quite some time to find exactly where the town was because this was a time where the internet was not really that much of a thing. So if you didn't know something about a video game, oh well, get better at the video game, I guess. That's a bummer, dude. That's a wet noodle of a bummer right there. Nintendo, please stop. Wall jump, you cuck. You're Super Mario, for God's sake, not Super Mabio. Three, that a boy. That's what I'm talking about. The jumps you make are only limited by your ability to make them. Enough of this. Just grab the pole. <laughs> Oh my god. I love video games. Come on, Mario, swim. Swim, Mario, swim. Swim. Swim, Mario! Son of a bingus, dude. I was so close. I could probably make it from here. How did I do that so perfectly the first time? I forgot about the old wall jump. I wasted a lot of time and made myself feel really stupid. So basically, it's just like any other day. Stroke and stroke and stroke. Go, Mario. Do the swim. And since I got ye old vanish cap, no, I won't stop saying ye old. I can easily get the last star of this world, man. Now I'm on Yahoo the level. Thank you, invisible wall. Ouch. That hurt my face. It was a very big ball. I legitimately have to climb this mountain like seven times, so it doesn't really matter the order of stars I do. To be honest, there's no good way to go about it. It, man. You go up the mountain, you get a star, you go up the mountain again. The only real difference is where you stop along the way. Fuck you! <laughs> Stupid Goomba. A big Goomba. Doesn't really change anything, I can still just jump on him. Well, must have been nice for him anyway. Alright, I'm not gonna let this guy do it to me. He's camping up there, he wants to throw me off. He's like every Luigi player in Smash. I'm always down for a rematch, dude. Fact of the matter is, is you're too slow. And I'm way too fast. In that way, you could say I share something in common with Sonic the Hedgehog. Ow, my bones. Why did I jump? Never jump right there. Jesus, man. I didn't realize he was such a jerk about when he wins. It's just a race and he only won because I jumped. Look, you're not gonna win this time. I won't be made a fool of twice in one day. See, this time I won't jump on the bridge. That's the secret to victory. It's really easy when you just don't do what you wanna do. Damn, dude, I guess you should be smarter with your money and not spend all of it on a pair of shoes, which isn't what makes you run faster. Before I get my star, that's what happens to people who cross me. Oh, it pains me so when I press buttons in the wrong order. I can't actually see what I'm doing, camera. Who needs to see where they're going when you have gaming to guide you, though? Please don't miss. I missed. That's a bummer. That's okay. I'll just take tiny Koopa shell. Give me your home, sir. I need it to invade someone else's home. I almost didn't want to say that sentence because it sounded weird, but then I just committed. No, that's not high enough. It's okay, there's always plan B, artillery. You know what they say, sometimes the easy way is the best way, right? Stealing from a wiggler. Hey man, it's okay because he's evil. He is evil. 
right? Punching that Goomba square in the face is ceremony for me. It's really relaxing. Why did I get hurt for that? Well, now that I've invaded his home, I might as well stomp on his head as well. He's totally the bad guy in this situation, man. I don't know what he's so mad about. It's not like I flooded his house and then jumped on his head three times. That's not something you should get upset about ever. Look, don't feel bad about the fact that he fell through the cracks in his own house and probably died. All we need to focus on is now that I've taken his star, he's happier. So technically, we've done good. 20 stars left to go, and all the worlds are unlocked. Feeling pretty good about our chances of beating this game within three hours? I'm not a coward. I'll do Rainbow Ride first. Um, hello? Hello, video game? Do you want to make some sense there? Oh, I missed my wall jump. I missed the style points, dude. I'm a fraud, Spider-Man. I'll do anything to keep myself from having to go that direction, even be in pain. Can you not do funky things to me when I'm trying to platform? Oh wait, it's Super Mario 64. That's literally all this game is. Oh, I guess these triangles just ain't that tricky for me, bro. They become a little bit simpler when you've got the skills to pay the bills. Dun, 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 dun. Gaming is my thing. I'll jump and jump and then I'll wall jump and then I'll long jump some more. Ha! My skills are top notch and have been since I was breathing oxygen, which is always. I officially have no other choice. I have to do the waiting stars. That's fine. That's exactly what editing is for. Left or, or right, I'm feeling left. This is the way I will freaking go. And I'm meant to do a somersault jump. Cool beans. If I'm gonna make catastrophic mistakes, I might as well do it on a level where there's pendulums around. I don't really know why I care about the pendulums, but it's better than no pendulums, I'll tell you that. This is the perfect description of this level. Go up a little bit, get a star. Go up a little bit more, get a star. A little bit more, get a star. A little bit more, get a star. The later levels have a pretty good amount of waiting in them. But fear not, loyal viewer, for I am your editing captain, and I'll be seeing us through to the next star. Wouldn't it be funny if I said that and just made you watch the rest of this? Don't worry, I won't do that. Or will I? I won't. I guess the mechanic of, like, changing the speed at which things in the level move is kind of cool. It's just not a huge deal. Like, it doesn't make a huge difference. Is that a jump that I could make right there? I mean, it is, but it'd be hard because of the camera. Let's go! Hell yeah, brother, that's what I'm talking about. Let's go again! Oh, dude. It's the little shortcuts that really make you feel like a gamer. I seem to have chosen a very fast speed for this run, which is all right, because I could just die and reset it. See, and now we've gone from quick time to no time. Funny how time works, isn't it? Okay, I overshot that one by a little bit. I'm willing to admit that. Only if you're willing to admit that you should probably hit subscribe, because let's be honest, a decent amount of you aren't, and it would be really helpful for me if you were. Things are going wrong for me right now. I know a thing or two about Super Mario Brothers for the 64 Nintendo Switch. Ow, my spine. I'm nothing but a damn fool with a crushed spinal column. It's all right though, if video games have taught me anything, it's that everything can be fixed. Which really makes me question why my parents divorced, shattering our family forever? Wow, that was a little bit of a depressing joke, but we'll throw it in there anyway, see how the people feel about it. Because it's either depressing or relatable, and I'm down for either to be my cause for comedy. Game's still a masterpiece though, for letting me go off the beaten path and get whatever star I want, in whatever order I want to get them in. That will never not be worth respecting. There's a reason why Odyssey had to go and copy that formula, dude. Because as fun as Galaxy and Sunshine are, there's just a certain beauty in the freedom that this game allows, man. You hop into Star 4, you get Star 3, and maybe you come back for Star 2, or maybe you don't. It's all on you. Camera, you wanna throw me a bone here? No? Okay. This level kind of reminds me of a Fall Guys course, which, now that I've said that out loud, would be 100% sick, dude! If they could... somehow... do a... crossover with... You know what? Maybe never mind on that front. That's okay. I could do it again. It's no problem. I've done it so many times already. Gamers persevere. Lamers give up when that going gets tough. Last thing I'd want to be is a lamer. Yahoo! Ha ha! I'm gonna throw that in there just because I feel like it. Ah! 
I almost fell again. I should be a little bit more patient. There aren't a lot of problems in life that can't be solved with a good old backflip or a triple jump. You can try to change my mind, but you won't be successful. Raise me up and I'll be out of your very hard hair. Now I'm just picturing a thwomp with hair, and now I've probably photoshopped a thwomp with hair, and here it is. I'm not sorry. Yo, I blasted through TikTok clock. I didn't even finish some of the earlier levels than I finished TikTok clock. That's crazy. Oh god, I'm gonna freeze to death. I'm gonna freeze to death. I froze, drowned to death. Where's that last one, baby? Let me have it. There it is. Hell yeah, dude. Nice. I really liked how that looked. Can you believe that the solution to this guy's big head is actually to get on this other creature's head? Yeah, I didn't believe it when I was five either. It took me like an entire year to come to terms with it. I swear to God, had I fallen off right there, I would have climbed back up and kept playing this game because I love it. Sand, cave, or ghost? Don't know which one I'll go to, but you'll know before I do. Turns out it was cave. Ow, my legs. Look at that boy shimmy! He's a good boy. He does a shimmy. And now we're coming into the territory of lowering the margin for error by somewhat of a frustrating amount. Not to say it's super hard or impossible, just to say that messing up and having to start all over isn't fun. You're on the wrong way, dude. I'm over here. Still the wrong way, but I respect the second attempt. Gaming jump! Oh no. Oh! Okay, I almost died, but I lived. Oh, but I lived with brain damage. Still better than not living. You know I'm not gonna wait for this elevator. It's not what I'm about. I'd rather break every bone in my body than wait for an elevator. I know my judgment is heavily clouded by nostalgia, but I really love almost every single level in this game, dude. I don't even care, it's so fun. Oh no, oh no! This isn't where I'm supposed to be. I'm not meant to be in the sand, I'm too hefty. That was not meant for you. That was meant to get me up there, but you refused to get out of my way, and now you've perished. Reasons I love this game, number 10 million, dude. Using my mobility to just say nope to obstacles. All right, I think I can do some water levels for the last few stars. That shouldn't be that big of a deal. Besides, it's cool. We got the music, the peaceful atmosphere. I vibe with it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Easy. This one? Mm, okay, it's not that one. Moving on. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Swim, Mario. Get out of there, brother. Ugh. Don't let them toilet bowl you, dude. You can't go out like that. It's too humiliating. People say water levels suck, dude, but look how easy it is when you're gaming. That's my secret, Captain. I'm always gaming. They want me to ride the merry-go-round, so to the merry-go-round I have came. And holy hell is this merry-go-round music loud. Tell me why like four of the six missions in this level are just fight Big Boo. I guess it is called Big Boo's Haunt, but still. Not all the bomb bomb battlefield missions require you to fight bomb bombs now, do they? So you might say that, hey, it's a little bit obvious why you fight Big Boo in Big Boo's Haunt. And to that I say, nice. Wow, dude, I can't believe I lived that. This is exactly where I meant to go. It's just not at all how I planned to get here. This is one of my all-time favorite stars just because of how, like, hidden I felt it was when I was a kid. Like, it's kind of hard to get to, you know? You gotta unlock the cannon and then do a super specific shot and then, like, go around the corner and then bounce off some walls, man. Like, I don't know, dude. Made me feel good when I was a kid. How can I be upset about anything when I'm over here kicking gravity's ass? Oh, why did I have to speak on it? I'm not even gonna try to explain that one. I'll just move on. Turns out the next level is actually the last level though. And I feel like this playthrough has done a pretty good job at showcasing all the levels. So I'm pretty comfortable with moving on to Super Mario Sunshine. And I plan on just chugging through all of the 3D Mario games. And if that's something you're interested in, then stick around and hit that subscribe button. Cause we're going through them, baby. In the meantime, bro, it's time to give Bowser his final commitments. He's been a naughty boy and I'm gonna give him a spanking for for it. Uh, can I take it back? <laughs> Only cool people do that skip. Lamers go the other way. People like to think that I suck at video games. I'm actually pretty good at most video games, and I wonder if my skills at this video game will demonstrate that, because I feel like this is harder than your average Mario game. Like, not by a lot, don't get me wrong, and part of that is because I grew up with it, but it's definitely harder than, like, new Super Mario Bros. for the Wii 6 or whatever. Oh, the piano! Oh, the Oregon piano, dude. 
nostalgia hits like a bus. Covered in goosebumps. Fuck yes, dude. I love this game. Bowser in the sky, brother. He's multicolored and about to blow up. Bye bye. Son, I'm gonna chain grab you like a lamer because I'm trying to win this tournament. You don't get to play the video game. It's called Super Mario 64, not Super Bowser 64. Bye bye There's just so much less energy to that than there was so long a Bowser. Can I get the three-peat with my eyes closed? LeBron! Bye -bye. Wow, I missed so badly. Bye -bye. Wow! I can't believe he didn't hit that. So iconic, dude. The visuals, the music, the sound effects, me defying physics by spinning on my butt perfectly. It's all perfect, and I'll love it until the end of time. Look at that, now he's a big star. The OG grand star that nobody likes to talk about. Hell yeah, dude, that's the princess! freaking saved her. Gotta throw her some respect. Take off the hat in her presence, know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, Mario's the original simp. The things he goes through for cake and maybe a kiss? That's some simp energy right there. Dude, the polygon peck of a lifetime though. All the near-death scenarios and risking life and limb worth it. It's the one in a million shot where simping pays off. What else can I really say? Game's a classic, a true masterpiece. If you've played it, you know why. If you haven't played it, what is your excuse? I guess I really just want to say thank you guys. It's been kind of a crazy year or so for me. And I know I've been throwing a lot of variety content at you and I'm just really happy that I'm in a spot where I can do it and be successful with it. So really to each and every one of you guys who watch this video or any of my videos really, Thank you. Do -do 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 I have died. It's a him, Super Mario. But again, banana. Show it to me. Oh, so delicious. They don't make nostalgia like they used to. Let me tell you that right now. Look at this dude. Look at how waddly he is. And succulent seafood. Oh, he's taken with the succulent seafood. Forget it, Peach. He's lost in the sauce. Dude, what even happened to Toadsworth, man? Nintendo just stopped using him, I feel like. Super Mario Sunshine! Hell yes. Aw, oh, man, being able to jump around in the file select screen is so cool. What does this even do? It makes me happy. That's what. The story of this game is kind of like, yeah, yeah, cutscenes, plot, development. And then it's just like, uh, uh, we forgot to make the rest. It's really weird to hear the toads speaking in full voiced dialogue, man. Get out of here with that 50 yard stare, girl. What are you looking at? Oh, look at that. You can't jump on the princess. That makes sense. She do be looking cute, though. There we go. That's the toad noises I like. Not to mention, Yellow Toad best toad? The one washer to rule them all. Mario is absolutely taken with him. Whoa, don't look down there. What are you, some kind of pervert machine? Ah, uh, yes, the button. I can't believe it's 2020. They ported Super Mario Sunshine to the Nintendo Switch and I am still forced to watch this entire cutscene. You've done me dirty, Nintendo. Perhaps for the last time. No. The fact that this game doesn't have GameCube controller support is actually just like the biggest crime of 2020. Not literally, but it's pretty bad. Oh, shine get! I'm video gaming, playing Super Mario in the sun-baked heat. Hmm, quite an unusual device. Is it some sort of pump? No, it helps me get arrested. The 5-0, illegal contraband, making a mess of things, mucking about. Mario in jail. Behold this sketch of the perpetrator based on eyewitness descriptions. Based on eyewitness it descriptions, huh? It is none other than Mario. Mario shall not be allowed to leave. Mamma mia. This is not a due process. Mario in jail, bro. <laughs> oh my god, Mario in prison. So funny. Oh, the movement, baby. The movement. The movement is so delicious. Dude, if you have a game with a solid foundation of movement, there's not a whole lot you can't get me to enjoy. Oh my god. It's Jesus Christ. Yo, Peach looking insanely cute, though, with the parasol ponytail combo. No. Peach? Peach, you wanna move? 
Peach. Peach. Come on, man. What are you doing? I fail to see why the toads can't help you in this situation. Although I do like the vibes you have going there. Kind of looks like she do be grooving, though. Is it completely unfair, though? You kind of were trying to do a kidnapping, which is, you know, a crime, and I stopped you. I think that that's pretty fair. Jeez, Peach, you don't gotta be so bossy. What if he has a gun? You ever consider that? You're sending me to chase a man with a gun. Oh, my particles. Oh, hell yeah, dude. You know I like me some Bianco Hills. Yeah, doing the first mission sounds cool and all, but what if I uh, <laughs> just didn't? Because I don't really need to, because all that really matters is the seventh mission. This game ain't your daddy's Mario 64. You can't just be doing whatever star you want. This is one of the only missions in the entire game you can skip. I love playing Super Mario. Even if it's in 3 d e or 2 d it's all cool. And then we have this unit of a boy just chilling up here. I'm gonna kill him. I blame you for this. Listen, listen, Petey Piranha. Can I interest you in a drink of ice-cold water? Don't worry, it's good for you, I swear, bro. Get your head in the game, Petey, come on. Don't barf, don't barf. No barfing allowed, only drinking. It's just like we're in college. Super Mario, ladies and gentlemen. The only time it's just always okay to be a murderer. He's dead! Look at these absolute units. They're not even trying to pretend to help. They're just running around, sitting around. They look like they were in big old diapers. Diaper babies. Ah, there we go. There it is. That's what I've been wanting to hear. Some of the greatest voice acting in all of gaming. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to be torn apart molecule by molecule. Ultimate belly slide. It's okay, Mario. We'll buff out all those bits of gravel that are now lodged in your nipples. This song is a freaking banger. This song is a, a banger. Oh my uh, uh, god. I love this song so much. It is one of the best songs. I could listen to it, it all day long. Okay, this time I'm not gonna bother trying to come up with lyrics and distract myself. I'm just gonna play the chorus, man. Ain't got flood, which means I got 99 problems, and gravity is 1 through 99 of those problems. Ooh, it's so hard not to sing along with it, though. Listen to that snapping chorus, dude. I must f focus so I do not die. But here I am singing to the song, oh yeah. This song is delicious to my earballs. It is the sh- uh, 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 It's bright. I will jump and then grab it, just like an epic gamer. I face the stupid shine. Now I'll get it again. I did not jump that way. And now I, I, I am dead. Bro, I'm all over the place for no reason. This game just gives me too much. It gives me too much movement options. The fluidity, the crispness. It's enough to make a grown Mario cry. Herpes! <laughs> I don't know why I said that. These are the big ups, man. The big ups from neutral because you can do a somersault dive like on the turn of less than a dime. Control's so precise that you can literally do like a backwards somersault dive from like a standing position. Check this. Subscribe for more good content. Boom, there we go. That's what I meant to do. Did you see that, man? Mario's got up. So now I'm gonna jump on this man's head. Seize my property. Just kidding. It's not cool to own people, says Mario. Allow me to introduce you to a mechanic of this game that I won't be taking part in in this playthrough. Blue frickin' coins, dude. It's just not happening. Don't even ask. Leave it to Nintendo to make cleaning up an area fun, dude. Plant season fire! Right upside the head. The man was just relaxing on a mountaintop, and I murdered him. What can I say? I need the gold. Murder! Gotta repress the urge to sing. Gotta repress the urge to sing. Focus on the platforming. Focus on the platforming. Oh, I didn't focus on the platforming very well. Holy hell, I'm getting bodied by this dirty-ass water, dude. Who would've thought that in a game about water, water would be my greatest enemy? Don't take my water! No, now I'm gonna be thirsty while gaming. Ah, big boy jump. The spin jump, dude. Learn it, live it, love it. It'll serve you well. I can make that. I will make it with the 
spin jump. Listen up, y'all. When daddy tells you to spin jump, you best be spin jumping, son. Maybe that wasn't the time to do it because I almost killed myself, but hey. Potato. The goal is get Shadow Mario in each level. And in this game, Shadow Mario is mission seven of each stage, which means you just have to do it all the way up to mission seven. And it, uh... Never gets better than that. Oh, Rico Harbor. How your black sludge and squid fights amuse me. But not as much as your complete banger of a tune, dude. There's gonna be a lot of singing in this video. I can already feel it. Enough nostalgia gushing about this game's amazing soundtrack. You already knew the music was gonna be a bop. Let's rip a poor defenseless creature's arms off. Really not as bad as you think it is. It's, uh, much, much worse. As we tear this man limb from limb. Imagine having no arms because a guy ripped them off. Don't imagine that. Take it all back. It was a funny prank the whole time. He can just grow his arms right back. He's totally the villain in this scenario still. Don't think about how I started the fight. Listen, buddy, I'm really sorry about this. If the game wasn't making me do this, I'd probably still do it anyway, because it's kind of fun. So I just hopped into a sewer, and a mysterious man inside said, Wahoo, you want to go for a ride, bud? No? No, I don't think I will. Platforming feet don't fail me now. Ah, uh, yeah, that is the optimal way to go. I've had like six opportunities to actually just get the shine, but I'm just having fun. I'm having fun moving around this jungle gym. This beauty of a level, dude. I can get you. I can track you down. You foolish candy cane crane. You can't escape from me. Tacos. What is mission four? I don't remember, but I'm going in sideways. Who needs a rocket nozzle or whatever when you've got the hover nozzle? Oh, okay. Uh, I was just going for the blue coin, man. That's all. Just going for the blue coin. I would never not hit jump. Come on. You guys know me. I'm better at video games than that. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I lived. Oh my God. I lived again. I'm the greatest of all gaming time. No, that's not the direction you were supposed to go. But what I lose in lives, I make up for in fun. And that is the true spirit of Christmas, Super Mario Santa Claus. And it's as simple as that. You ever take a couple of minor drops into an endless abyss? Then we pop the cork, and then we fight him again. And then I kind of point out how sunshine isn't really the best one. And then I fall right off because I wasn't paying attention. And then I jump into some freaking in deadly water and get stun locked to death. Unfortunate gaming has occurred. Just go into the stratosphere and then into the ocean. Um, snag. That's what I'm talking about. What are you talking about? Are you talking about the fact that Mario literally just drowned? Let's see. I can't blame it on lag like I normally do. I can blame it on not being used to playing this game with this controller. a boy. Don't touch anything because everything is instant death. Now we just come over here. You could even... What are you doing? Don't do that. Don't scare me. Oh, now I've got to get the shine without dying. No, that's not what I wanted. I don't like this camera angle. What the hell was that? Why, Mario Sunshine? Why? Some would say that this game has a lot of bugs and quirks. Others would say that it's just poorly made. I personally would agree. Still a great game though, but definitely jank as hell. And that brings us back to the Spray the Man mission. And this completes the Spray the Man mission. You kind of get why these missions are stupid. As much as I love this game, and as deep as the nostalgia runs, they really cut some corners with it, and it shows. I don't even care, actually, though. This game just makes me so happy that I'm willing to overlook all its flaws and just enjoy it, man. I can confidently call it a masterpiece. A masterpiece out of 10. You want to do a backward somersault on one square platform, bro? No problem. You want to do a spin jump on a tiny thing of sand? We got you. This is Super Mario Sunshine, where the controls are so tight, something funny and also appropriate. Blue Mario, Blue Mario, calm down. Talk to me, son. What's wrong? Bro, that happens literally every day. I wouldn't worry about it. I'm gonna go back to the beach and have some more fun. Also, so did Mario just dab? I am playing Mario Sunshine on the Nintendo Switch. If you like it, please think about hitting subscribe. So long, Gay Bowser. I know it's the wrong game, but the principle still applies. There we go, there we go, there we go. That's good, right? Yeah, that's good enough. I don't know why he defied me, but now he's a corpse. Keep that in mind. V.
viewers. Oh, he mad. He a big angry lad. Super Mario Sunshine might be a little bit more brutal than I remember. People be getting disintegrated left and right. Oh no. Young me struggled with the sandbird. To put it lightly, obviously when I got older, it turned out to not be such a big deal, but when I was first playing this game as a youngin, many a tear was shed, let's just say that, because, uh, whoa, camera! You wanna zoom back in there, buddy, so I can see what I'm doing. Oh, he's turning around already. I didn't expect this. This is, uh, too sudden for me. And the camera, the camera! Jesus Christ, the camera! The camera! I hope this email finds you well how this email finds me. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, <laughs> why, camera? Why this angle, bro? God, what a nightmare. Ah, I almost fell, but then I didn't. And then the camera, again, just decided to go all the way out. Very cool level, very not stressful at all. Just super fun and easy all the time forever. Red coins are pretty hit or miss for me. I feel like most of the time they just kind of are there. And then I do them because Nintendo tells me to. At least the music is pleasant. I'm gonna sing because it's what I do. You all know this. It's why you're here. Or at least you're here in spite of it. I'll sing all day until I get what I want. And right now that's red coins. Where are you, red coins? There is only two uh, of you left. Reveal your set elves to me. I know you're hiding in the reef. I know you'll be mine one day. And then I won't have to search anymore. Hey! Oh my god, there he is. It's Shadow Mario. How will I defeat him? Would you believe it if I had told you you would defeat him the literal same way you always defeat him? Communism. I mean, um, <laughs> he's got a paintbrush. Better watch out. As you can see, Peach is getting kidnapped and she's clearly doing all she can to escape. I don't want to have to go to my lawyer who's also a toad and file a harassment claim at you, but I will do so if necessary. We're going to go fight a big robot. And then after the robot is done, we won't see or hear a single word from the plot. I didn't want you to do that to me. He is Jesus Christ confirmed. Who knew that being one inky boy? <laughs> Mario's dumb face! Like, actually, though, how is he floating? It doesn't make any sense. It's not even explained. He's just defying gravity. That's an amazing ability. Bowser Jr. OP. This is what we call a uh, robotic chungus. <laughs> and everyone died. That's the end of the game. This mission sucks like balls. I don't want to do it, but here we fucking are. Let's see if I can hit him from downtown. From downtown. Oh, I got him. Did you see that? That's how you know I'm a gaming, uh, a gaming gamer is what I meant to say. From really downtown. How about that, huh? Is that going to hit? Oh my God. I am so good at video games. Peach literally has to like think about it. She's like, yo. I've been sleeping around, so, I mean, it could be, though. Peach, t t tell me it didn't happen. Tell me it didn't go down like that. Look at this dumb, smug face. He's like a smug anime girl. So I tried to get Mario sent to prison. <laughs> so I tried to get Mario sent to prison. Just what a sentence. So I tried to get Mario sent to prison. And there it goes, ladies and gentlemen. There goes the plot of Super Mario Sunshine. Never to return. Bum, 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 bum. Herpes! Uh, I blew up, but then I bounced on the explosion because I'm Mario. Die, you dumb animal. That is all I have to say. Me and the boys at 2 a.m. looking for water guns. I promise I won't sing this song this time. I make no promises about later on, though, because this song shows up a lot and it never stops being a banger. And I'm only human. Oh! Oh! Oh no! I almost died. 
That would have been sad. I really like this game. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I shouldn't do that. I said I wouldn't. Pinot Park is actually probably my least favorite stage in the game. It's not that I have anything against it. It's just like not that good, I guess. I don't know what this game's hard on for red coins is all about. I gotta get rid of these guys anyway, right? See ya! Wouldn't want a freaking be ya! Oh wait, be ya! There you go. Yours ugly. <laughs> They're not all winners, am I right? And then just grab that coin and fly right on over here. We don't even have to... Why, Mario? Why, Mario? Why, Mario? Why have you done it? Defend yourself and I maybe won't make you commit Harajuku. That's a place. Omaha Beach is what I'm going to say this time. Gotta wake up the wannabe Yoshi boys and then kill them. Because everything in Mario boils down to killing wildlife. There we go. All the sunflower children have awoken. It's time to awaken the big sunflower boy. Only then. Will I be satisfied? Why? I didn't even do anything. You just hit me in the face. I woke up and you put a wall up inside my grill. Oh my god, he's getting away. He's so hard to chase. Oh my god, what will I ever do? I like that his theme music is proximity based. Like you go too far away and it's just like... It just fades out. Makes me think he's got a little tiny boom box in his pocket. You ever seen a man belly slide up the stairs? That's the kind of guy I am. But hey, I can promise you that uh, I'm not about to actually do a level when there's cheese available. It just isn't going to happen. Your life expectancy just got shortened because Mario came around. I'm a murderer. Wahoo! Take me to my destiny. Yeah. The power of the sun. <laughs> in the palm of my hand. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Yoshi. All right, now he's orange. We can impale him. That's the secret, boys. Impaling your friends. Mario sure is a hero. But hey, anything to A, get to this secret plane of existence where the music is constantly a bop, and B, get to Power Star so that we can, uh, shimp. Uh-oh, that's not good. Why did I decide to try to do that? We'll never know. I am riding on a platform. I hope that you subscribe. <laughs> Sunflowers. <laughs> I'm losing it. I don't know why, but I am. I probably never had it, though, to be honest. Oh, fuck! I really didn't want that to happen. Here we go. Third time's the charm. This time, no move will be wasted, and then we can just get the shine and not die like an idiot. Explode me, daddy. Why kill him in the plaza when I can kill him in the park? You can't keep me out of prison forever. Yoshi, get in there. Don't teleport outside. Get inside. Me and my brother used to have a hell of a time with this level, man. This level's the stuff of nightmares. Literally, they frame it as a nightmare, and it's just straight up a nightmare. <laughs> Could you imagine, like, being in this scenario? So this nightmarish frickin' man strolls up, and he's got one goal. He wants your ass to be grass. You gotta kill it with water. Look at how much of him there is. And you just gotta kill him with the H2O. Even though he came out of the H2O, so, like... Killing him with H2O doesn't really make a lot of sense. Spray my load. Spray my load everywhere. I want you all to die. You cannot get me. You cannot get me. You are not real. Obviously, it got manageable as I got, you know, older and better at video games. But back in the day, this was tough stuff. You could get stun locked kind of easily. It's just kind of creepy, man. Like, look at them coming at you and they're all pink and making their little sounds. It's nasty. Objective complete, babies. We lived. So a little bit of a reminder for anyone who didn't know, this is actually in the shape of a GameCube controller. Doesn't really mean anything now, since they didn't add GameCube controller support, but it was cool back then. Up and through the mouth and the experience what the boo experiences. It's theft. He experiences theft. Here's a little fun fact about myself. I never lose. I always win, especially when gaming. And before you comment, no, I've seen you die before, Desbug. Before you comment that, no. All those times, you were mistaken. That didn't actually happen. So a spicy meatball. I don't even know what that's supposed to mean. I'm going back in here. Help, I can't see. God, work with me. Please work with me. No, no. Isn't it obvious? I did it all for the pineapple. Because Mario isn't a peach simp. He's an orange Yoshi simp at the end of the day. Camera. Camera, help me out. That's not what I wanted to do. Now I have the power to consume the spirits. 
Such a power must not be treated lightly, although I will consume anyone who opposes me. Imagine being a ghost and still getting eaten alive. And that means you must be consumed. <laughs> I will kill all that stand in my way. Victory is mine. Victory is not only mine, but it is also Yoshi's. Yoshi indeed, friend. This is the dumb gambling part of the game. Give me the triple sevens. Give me the triple sevens right now. Otherwise, my gambling addiction can't end. Oh, I won big one coin. And it only cost me my marriage and my entire life savings to get in here. So that's a win. Wow, three coins. I feel so blessed. I'm sure this will be fun without the precision of a GameCube controller. God, it's agonizing. Ooh, but it's not that agonizing, except for I still have the whole top row. It's like pulling needles out of my anus, dude. I swear to God. Hey, there we go. Wait, what? Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, there we go. It only took me a couple more seconds. Definitely didn't take 20 more minutes. <laughs> Why does this one have birds in it? No, oh, no, right into the hole. That's a bummer. Oh, God, no! Now I have to do this stupid puzzle again. I hate this. I hate this so much. Come on. Come on. Don't. Don't do it. 2,000 years later. Jesus, 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 man. Why does it have to be this way? Oh, one more. Just, 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 just stop. Hooray. Whoa there. <laughs> Whoa there. Making big chumps, Mario. Mario with the helicopter arms. Mario the helicopter Hanson. Big block. Really big block. This could be a Fall Guys thing if they actually updated that game. And we've entered the belly of the beast. Deep down below, King Boo. Deep from down underground. I don't know why I'm talking like this, but I'm gonna stop. Bro, that is so many boos. What, what, what is that? That's so many boos. Come here, god dang it. Please, please, I don't wanna do this anymore. I did it. Oh my god, at the last possible second, I did it. Oh, he exploded. That's not good for him. This mission is dumb. So I'm not gonna show it to you. Shadow Mario checks in! Get it? Because it's a hotel! God, if it were any funnier, it'd have to start its own YouTube channel, and then I'd have to be worried because I'd have competition. Blah. My god, the level of challenge has really skyrocketed. I really misjudged this one. Oh, wait. No, I didn't. Can I just tell you that these are the grossest looking things? I don't like a chain chomp with two parts to it. It just needs to be a circle. Prepare to join your brethren in the drowning pool. I mean, in the bath. Always be kind to your pets as I drown all three of them. Good message, Mario Sunshine. What the fuck? We gotta go way over there. That's so far. I'm so fast. It's unreal, bro. Have you seen me run lately? Jesus Christ, I was booking it. So this is one of my favorite levels in the game. They cover the whole floor in lava, and then you have to find your way back to Flood because they take him away from you. And it's fun. There's a lot of ways to go about it. Hiya! Ow. 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 Oh, he committed small body of water. You hate to see a man drift that far away from reality, but it happens. Ooh, clean, clean, clean jump, though. And look at how happy he is now that I've sprayed my liquid on him. Ugh. It's time to wash the big boy. And a big boy needs a big wash. So what better place to wash the big boy than the big bath? Oh, look at that. He hopped right in. He wanted it. He knew he needed it. Oh, look at how happy he is. He's cute. Yeah, this is the Chuckster mission. I'm definitely in danger. The mission that relies on the Chucksters. <laughs> A name that surely brings with it terrible memories for most. These dudes like to throw you, and you best be hoping that their aim is on point, because if it isn't, you're a dead man. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm about to put my life in this man's hands. And he's not really all that concerned with my survival. Can you chuck me at just the right angle? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, yes. He chucked me right perfectly. I'm surprised I did that with only one death. Usually it's a hundred. Heheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheh
Well, I have officially put it off for as long as I possibly could have. I now have no choice but to look into the sun and destroy my retinas. And exactly what may lie at the end of this treacherous hidden path, you may ask? Well, the answer to that is an endangered species and his children, <laughs> neither of which will be surviving this encounter with Mario, the destroyer of worlds. It don't really matter how innocent you are or where you try to hide. Mario will kill you for the gold. Oh, and there goes your last method of self-defense. Sucks to be you right about now. So long, gay squid friend. I'll see you in squid hell, I guess. It's time to do the level in which Mario Sunshine tries to remind me to brush my teeth. I don't want to do- I don't want to go down there. I don't want this. Jesus Christ, that was terrifying. Sweet, sweet, delicious money. Where would I be without money? There we go. I cleaned the big monster's teeth, and now maybe he'll stop trying to eat me. Because it's not cool to try to eat your dentist. I don't even want to talk anymore. <laughs> Are you choking me? It's almost like his weakness is water in a game about shooting water. <laughs> Wouldn't that be something? Quite honestly, the most impressive thing this little turd has ever done somehow cause a massive flood of biblical proportions. How he do that? And now I go to a level that cannot be named, for otherwise I will become demonetized. For simplicity's sake, we'll just call it insta-kill the level. Touch the lava, dead. Touch the fire, dead. Touch the spikes, dead. If a young me could have some words with this boat, dude, they would not be kind words. It's just a combo of all video game BS. It's hard to control, and if you even touch anything, even a little bit, your ship is sank, and your skin is as good as melted it off. Come on in, Mama Peach. She's like, uh, I'll freaking die. I'll die hella hard, actually. Mario. I don't know why they thought it'd be a good idea to have Bowser speak English. I'd be a uh, hard pressed to call this a boss fight. Bowser just kind of shoots fire that's way too slow to do anything, and Junior shoots the most inconsequential bullet bills on planet Earth. Meanwhile, you run around as Mario and butt slam everything in sight. Do that five times and you're the Winamon. It's quite simple, really. You just hit him with that fat skadoosh and their whole plan crumbles mario was i um assist um here you go sensei sign me up for a big ass i mean a, a big a <laughs> mario in space Mario up in the uh, space Oops, I turned my volume all the way down But that's okay because I know this song by heart Oh yeah Please hit the subscribe button before you watch this video I don't know if I'll keep this in But I am doing it anyway Alright, I'm out of breath, let's go Mario and fucking space. I said the F word, I don't care. <clears throat> I'm gonna push A now. You are Mr. Gay. <laughs> oh, look at that, a little Mario profile. Um, I'm clicking on Mario's big head, giving it a little spin. I can't tell you how wrong this feels without using a Wiimote. Every hundred years, a butt comes across the planet and farts right on top of it. The butt was so big that both pink and red Mario together watched it rained down subscriptions from the sky. This is an abridged version of the story. I don't know if you guys know this one. All the colored Marios relished in the subscription that they had gained because while they hadn't uploaded in a week, they knew that people still cared. The Marios thought that this was taking a little bit of a personal turn, so they decided to skip the next page of the storybook. Uh, Majora's Mask Moon or something. Moving on. Oh, dear Mario. I'm gonna cut you off right there, Peach. I know you're waiting for me and my Italiano Sassiojo. That's Italian for, uh, hot penis. Oh, this feels wrong. Like, <laughs> don't get me wrong, it looks fine and all, but oh, I should be playing with a Wiimote and Nunchuck. I'm actually just gonna be terrible at collecting star bits in this. Ah, yes, death and destruction raining down upon the Mushroom Kingdom in what can only be described as a true act of war. This one just hit different. You got toads being encased in crystals, shit blowing up all over the place, dude. This ain't your average Mario story. This is intense. Yo, Peach, looking stunning in 1080p or whatever this game is running at. I wish I was that Luma. Am I right, guys? The cinematography is just the most extra it's ever been. And I'm about it. That guy is 
literally dead. With the power of space nipple lasers, Bowser has to abduct the entire castle. Because taking just the princess, that's that's too simple, man. That's baby plans. These are master plans. Bum, 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 bum. I should have said like, please hit subscribe. That would have fit perfectly. Imagine if I did that. Pretend, in fact, that that is what I did. That castle's in space, dog. Mario! Bro, stop breathing so loudly, Mario. <laughs> Mario died in space. The movement in this game is so stiff compared to all other 3D Mario games. I gotta say, I'm not the biggest fan of it. Oh, hell yeah, I caught you. Caught you right by the asshole. I mean, um, something less weird. What the hell? All right, and here we have, um, best Mario girl. Best Mario princess? I don't care, man. She big, I'm into it. And Rosalina, come on. That's a better name than Peach or Daisy. <laughs> I'm just gonna, like, burp and put it into the video. I'm, I'm, I'm starting to, like, um, get into the point with YouTube where I'm getting overly comfortable with uh, you, the audience. So a lot more of my personal habits are gonna start just, you know, making their way into videos. Cause I think it's funny and I don't really care if nobody else thinks so. You might say that that's bad content and I might say, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Yo, this is the game with the weird ass looking Goombas. Look at him. Yeah, the weird looking Goombas, they're a uh, weird champ. Normal Goombas pog champ. Where are you big Goomba? Boom, boom. Smacked and killed like the giant bitch you are. <laughs> Give me the big star. However, will I defeat this electric machine? Certainly not by running into it twice in a row. I would never do that. And if I did do it twice in a row by accident, then I definitely wouldn't do it three times. That ain't me. Why is the screen shaking? What is this? Such a big star. Certainly only a big celebration music can honor such a big star. I got a big star. <laughs> Forgot to throw that part in there. She's got epic hair, man. I really, really like it. Please. Whoa, I forgot sometimes she says a word out loud. Makes me wonder why they're afraid to do voice acting. What's up with that, Nintendo? Try to explain yourselves down in the comments below. I know you're watching. When you look at me like that, you know, I pretty much, I have to do whatever you say. <laughs> I'm a simp. I'm Simper Mario. Incoming! Bam! And the first of many spaces wildlife has to be murdered. Like, this is literally a baby. I'm about to kill a baby. You've only just been born. Simultaneously, it's time for you to die because I need what you have, apparently. I'm the hero in this story. Don't question it. Time to murder a child. An infant, really. Ooh, the tongue sticking out. That's how you really know it's dead. I mean, I guess exploding also kind of gives it away, but that's besides the fact. I got the power star by murdering an infant. I would collect all these blue things, but you know, a long jump will do the trick just as well. Because no matter what game it is, long jump is always going to be one of my favorite pieces of movement. Rest assured, knowing that when I become the B-Man, I will be asking damn near everyone if they like Jazz. Hell yeah, dude. Now I'm a bee and I got a sweet beanie and everything. Oh, wait, I have a sweet bee me. I'll just delete my channel now. You'd never believe how well that I stick to these things. You best be apologizing to me once you see my unbelievable skills. Uh, I'm not a physician, but I do be long on your beautiful booty. You like jazz? <laughs> I'm gonna touch your pod. Gonna climb around that thorax. I don't know if that's actually what it's called, but I'm gonna touch you regardless. Oh yeah, dude, it's Captain Red Mario. I'm not an actual bee, my guy. Their little crew's pretty rad. I really especially like the dude that sleeps all the time, also known as Yellow Mario. Purple Mario's pretty cool though. I thought he died, but he, he do be, he do be not dead. He do be not dead and doing something that, quite honestly, should be impossible. He's so much more low poly than I thought. Yo, that's a wiggler. Whereas my girlfriend calls them a hamburger. But now he's dead. Why did I kill him? I don't know. He was in my way. I mean, not really. He was just near. That's all it takes. 
Super Mario, more like Super Murdero. Super Murdero kind of sounds like it could be cereal. Probably be near impossible to market for though. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. First I will kill your baby. Then I will kill you when you try to defend your baby's honor. You should have known better than to tussle with Super Murdero. Camera angles in this game go hard. King Caliente's Battle Fleet. I like that name. King Caliente. Sounds pretty cool. Time to kill him, though, because, you know, he's just not me. Silly Nintendo, you think I would actually do platforming when you've given me tools such as the jump spin, wall jump spin jump? Truly, you are foolish this day. Now, Green Toad. Green Toad is worth saving. Though I'm not going to speak to him. I just wanted to save him. I'm sorry, I'm um, Green Mario, not Green Toad. I don't know who Green Toad is. <laughs> Whoops. Um, why did I get burned? I didn't do anything. I just watched the cutscene. Just don't punish me for watching the cutscene, Nintendo. Bam, 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 bam. Get good, King Caliente. Get good at smacking a coconut thing back, you stupid octopus man chilling in the lava. That's what you are. I should collect the star now. I'm Super murder -o, Super murder -o. Sometimes it changes. Dude, this game is gonna take like an hour to two hours extra longer to beat just because of all this in-between. Just give me the star and get me going. You're gonna tell me all my stats and what I discovered and show me where I discovered it. Tell me about Hungry Lumas. Oh my god, I don't care. No, I'm not gonna save my game. I'm not a weenie. Would you look at that? <laughs> In the background, it's my worst nightmare. It's 1-1. One, one. Can't escape it, no matter what I do. Oh, you can do the next level that you found. You probably already knew that, though, because we showed you in 8 million different ways. Do you want to save your game, you little weenie boy? That's a big Bowser head. I'm going to hit the armored Goomba into Black Hole Town. No, 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 no. Black Hole Town, US... Oh my god, I didn't know that would do that to him. I'm so sorry. He's got two teeth. Yeah. I like Bowser Jr. sometimes. I like his really big nose. Like, it's almost... Yoshi sized big. Look at that thing. That's quite big. And if only this level was a threat at all, it'd be kind of interesting. But instead, you just walk up his big body, touch his big head, and make him shoot himself. That's what I do to 95% of my victims. Give me the big. I've got one really big star. That's it. That's all the lyrics I can think of. I'm just going to talk over the rest of it. Subscribe or something. I like this level because it has fun music. And if you mess up a jump, you just die. Like that. <laughs> I got the star. This level's got some very peaceful and serene music, which I feel like is fitting because it kind of looks very, I don't want to say empty, but calm. I don't know. Gives me dire, dire doc vibes, you know? You should not have looked at me. This time I have to save all the colored Marios, but I only do it because they make me. A rescue isn't a real rescue if you have to rescue. Oh no, somebody please rescue me. <laughs> Nobody expected the true star of the show to be female magic Hoopa. Proud of her, she's shattered the gender norms all the way back in 2007. If my memory serves right, this is the level where you just kind of stand there. Probably just uh, slice this one out of the video, you know? They're not all winners. Now to launch myself at the star with perfect timing as to not jettison myself into space. Hell yeah, brother. This game is easy. What was it made for literal babies or something? Ugh. Top Maniac and the Top Man Tribe. Can I start calling you guys the Top Man Tribe? And we come to the quintessential Mario Galaxy enemy. The spinning top guy. He's dead and I am not. Cause I killed him. I killed him. Bum, 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 bum. The return of Koopa Road. Music to my ears. They knew what they were doing with the soundtrack on this one. Oh no! I've made a horrible, impatient mistake, and now my body is torn asunder at the atomic level. Whoa! Why did that happen to me? Oh, it's Bowser. He's spitting hot of fire. Oh, I'm sorry. He's spitting hot meteors this time. That's a bit of an upgrade from the usual. And now we come to the face off. Bowser, close your mouth, you mouth breather. Coincidentally, this fight also happens to have the single best song that ever came out of the entire Galaxy franchise. Don't even bother trying to at me on that. Dude, sick backflip. This has always been one of my favorite levels. Something about the aesthetic. 
beach aesthetic OP plus toilet bowl aesthetic. What even other game has a toilet bowl as a level? Plus, I love these little penguin dudes. They're so cute, man. They definitely got a big upgrade from Mario 64. I mean, just look at how cool this is. Like, the water all spilling over, but like staying all together somehow. Ah, oh, man, this level's sick. I don't usually even like water levels either. Look at that beautiful toilet bowl, man. That's hilarious. It's a toilet. I'll take that, you big, giant, blue, dumb bastard. That's way more words than I wanted to say, but you get the idea. Bro, stop drowning yourself. You're so dumb. Don't you want to live? Now, I am Ice Mario. I can jump up the waterfall. I will go until I can't go anymore because that's how it works. I am ice. Now I'm going to not eat ice. There you go. Now I'm not ice anymore. All right. I got the star. Now I can't stop singing. Yeah. You know what they say, a little spooky scary never spooked or scared anyone, right? That's totally how it works. Launch star. The green one needs rescuing, and who am I to deny him said rescue? I mean, look at him after all. He's freaking terrified in there. Don't worry, dude, I'll save you. I'll save you with the most underutilized power-up in all Mario history. The Boo Mushroom. Look at that unit. Oh, he's coming for you. Got his tongue out and everything. Don't worry, brother. I've got you. Yeah! He really just materialized that out of what can only be described as his butthole. Uh, you knew I had to take it there, so I don't apologize for anything. No, no, sir, I'm not going in there. Much too sad for me. I'm trying to have fun, not be depressed. Already got enough of that going for me in 2020 as is. Oh, what a good camera angle. This game do be having the angles, though. This is like the floor is lava times a million. Because instead of just burning up when you touch the ground, you fall into the green void forevermore. Hello, Monsieur Star. Would you like to join my collection? Whoa, <laughs> wee, I'm French now, yeah? Super Frenching Mario. Look at that, man. DJ chilling up on that roof. Bro, grab me. Bro. Bro, grab me. There's literally a warp pipe right there. You could just jump off this roof, actually. Why are you so losery when I'm not playing as you? <laughs> Don't be such a weenie, Luigi. The weenie. Maybe that's what I'll start calling you. That's true, it is you. Oh, sick gainer. That was impressive. I have to give him that one. Truly an advanced piece of machinery, if not for its one fatal weakness. The mighty turtle shell. He never saw it coming. Big star, baby. Another big star. It is mine, it is mine, it is mine. The lyrics are not always creative. Oh, hell yeah, now we can go to the bedroom. Catch me in there with Rosalina. Mario's a super simp. Yo, this level's sick. Fire meets ice, or like dope meets dope. Plus I can ice skate. Please don't call me old man. Also, that is not ice skating. Oh baby, a triple. Enough playing nice with ice, it's time to Shrek some dudes with fire. I don't have a rhyme for that. No, I went too speedy for my own good. Oh, well at least I didn't die. I would say that on average, living is better than dying. Not always. But usually. I get the star. Okay. Got that final burp out. Really does the soul well. Get it all out of my system. Oh no. A big ice cube, man. The true ultimate enemy. What a joke. Not even a good one. Look out, guys. It's a tough encounter. First he slams down. Then you spin into him. I don't know if you guys can handle that sort of thing. You gotta be pretty gamer to be able to do it. Luckily for me, I'm 70% gamer. I can't explain how much I hate the fire flower being on a timer. Makes it feel like a wet noodle. Come on. Hell yeah, brother. Sniped that baby. I'll make you eat those words. Uh, you're the real faker. I t my brain is a pile of garbage. Bunnies in the wind. That's the name of my band. Na -na 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 -na. Oh, oh yeah. We're all too familiar with this song, aren't we, lads? What did I call you guys before? Um, 
something tummies tickly tummies i don't know we'll just go back to the uchiha clan oh wait 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 wait. it was the um the top man the top man the top man tribe or something like that you get the point we know what this song is all about i've sung it enough times soaring through the sky but not really more like space, that is what I am doing. I am in great pain because of this dude's large face. <laughs> a weird way to put it. Before time, there was the cube. Look out, I'm gonna get you. I got you right in the ass. You're hot and you're cold. You're yes and you're no. You're yeah then you're who. You're woo then you're who. <laughs> I'm going to stop now because I think it's gone past entertainment into cringe. Oops, bro. Did you just post cringe? Is it more cringe to post cringe or to hear cringe? Cringe down in the comments below. Oh, I'm dead. I'm alive. I shouldn't be so reckless, but here I go being reckless once again. Pog champ. I just went poggers. Super pog champ. Pog champ. I'm collecting stars like nobody's business. I'm a star collecting fool. Plumber? Nah. Starer. Oh, you got a super big dumpo off the course. I don't know. Shut up. So you don't want to mess up a jump when you're going from the Tetris long piece to the Tetris T. Oh, and the goaded piece of Tetris, the plus sign. Truly a piece ahead of its time. I will take another granite star. Oh my god, it is so big. I'm holding it. The more of these I do, the less creative they get. I apologize. <laughs> That's quite a bit more stars to gather, Rosalinda. I mean, <laughs> oh my God, Rosalina. Jesus Christ. I really wanted to play this level because it has super good music. I mean, the soundtrack of this game, I don't even need to praise it. You guys know how dope it is. And if you don't, then you're probably an infant and you shouldn't be watching this channel. Lit Bill. Please blow up the cage. I'm so tired of my singing getting interrupted, bro. Oh, my bones. Surely they have been exposed. People who say that this is the best 3D Mario really forgot how they got away with cloning an entire level just by mirroring it. Oh, frig. Oh, good. The millionth mission where I get to catch a goddamn bunny. What is this game's obsession with bunnies? It's funny, they're like, oh yeah, evil force took all our power stars. Like half of them are owned by bunnies. Are bunnies the true villains all along? Come on, you squishy little lad. I need you to follow me. I've got great places to be, and you need to take me there. It ain't easy being beasy. <laughs> oh boy, I should probably take a break soon. It's just like three minutes of straight up silence followed by that absolute Zinger. Well, you know what they say, um, I got a dump truck of an ass, and it's gonna blast you to bits. I don't know who says that, but let's start it. God, how do I tell them apart? Which one do I shoot? They're so identical in every way, except for every way. Yeah, this level's pretty cool, aesthetically speaking. Although it does have one of the worst power-ups in it of all time. The spraying mushroom. Because turns out, boing isn't a fun mechanic. Oops. I have fallen into deep space, and I can't get up. I mean, I walked literally right into that one. What can I say? Sometimes I just want to feel alive by having my skeleton shown to the world. That's one small step for Mario. One giant leap onto big Mario kind. Hoo Large jump. Large jump FTW. Ooh, look, it's just like the end of every phase one Marvel movie. <laughs> oh. Oh, I really did it to him, didn't I? You didn't deserve it. Ah, yes, this spicy return of King Caliente. So spicy a meatball. This calls for the ultimate weapon. Give us some heat, King Caliente. Because you worked out so well the first time. Oh no, he hit it back once. Will he be able to hit it back twice? Yes, but what about three times? No, I don't think so. He's down for the count. This is it. Another big star to place right into my anus. Deep Dark Galaxy. Creative name, guys. I must say, I do like the, like, dark abandoned beach vibe, though. That's pretty neat. Just because it doesn't have the best name doesn't mean it doesn't have a cool aesthetic. Whoops, I did not mean to kill that ghost. Oh, okay, you're coming from the moon this time. Gotta mix it up, I see. Oh, you running away. 
Think I won't chase you down? This ghost ship about to be your du double grave. Oh, you're lucky your boy took that shot for you. That was coming right for your gizzard. Nice. Whoa, I'm in a bubble. You know, as much as I hate the fish in the Mario universe, this is one of the only levels I can actually think of them being in. Which is weird, considering they're not even in the water right now. Oh well, I won't have time to ponder that as I'm in the bubble. Oh, that's right, I have to shoot the tennis balls at the watermelon to make the watermelon grow. This game's kind of weird. There you go, one colossal watermelon courtesy of slamming tennis balls into it. Ask less questions. It'll be easier that way. By the end of this, I'm gonna have a couple of screws loose. Ha <laughs> ha! Frickin' got him. All right. I was just thinking that I'd like to do that section again. Don't look this way. I said don't look! Accidentally in space. <laughs> the nightmare is almost complete. I can see my goal. As long as I don't get lasered in the tuchus. Slash crotch. Slash entire skeleton. Oh god. My absolute unit of a dump truck. It's too much for the ancient spire to handle. I should have known I'm too dummy thick. Oh my god, look at my huge fists. That's nasty. Uh-oh. I don't think I can make that jump. Uh-oh. I think I tried to move a little bit too early. Jump into meteor. I think monkey brain confirmed. If not monkey brain, then what? Damn, the meteor to lava pit combo. Would you guess that the moment I step onto the gimmick motion control thing, I die? Because I would guess that. Oh my god, look at me go, look at me go, look at me go, nothing can stop me. Jesus Christ. Talk about being on a roll. <laughs> Subscribe. All right, time to kill another baby. Become born so that I may murder you, please. Then consider a middle-aged plumber comes to your home. He's an alien, by the way. A alien to you, at least. He wakes you up from your slumber of birth, hatches you, and then proceeds to murder your face. Somehow you're the villain. So here I am, ready to die in quicksand. Just kidding, you know me, I would never die in quicksand. Unless it was for the joke. Oh Jesus, Helicopter Mario, that's right. Oh, this game is wacky. Oh, see it's funny, right? <laughs> I just did it for you guys, for the joke. That's all it was. Oh, is right, baby. Let's go get that Bowser booty. Go, Mario. Okay. You, who says you get to order me around, though, you know? I'm kind of my own guy. Uh, you're a little close to my head. Jesus Christ. Never had a bullet so near my body before. Look at that, isn't that the last launch star? I'm kind of already almost there. This is really not as long of a level as I remember it being. I mean, I see that. God, he got so much bigger from Sunshine to this game. Look at how much bigger than Peach he is. Remember in that game, he was actually smaller than her? That's crazy. Don't worry, baby, I got you. Oh, I'm starting to get the epic goosebumps. The final showdown is upon us. I mean, that's kind of just a little bit scary. Blink, please. Also, I love the little detail that now Bowser Jr. has his little mask on. He's like, yeah, it's go time. Let's do this. Look at his little face in the boulder. That's so cute. <laughs> Whoa-pow! Right in the kisser. Think you could come at me in boulder form, buddy? It's gonna take more than an earthbender to stop Mario. Boom. Bam. How? The sound of my heart, the beat goes on and on and on and on. He got me that time. God, dude, this song slaps. Why does the music in this game go so hard? That is it, Bowser. You done. You done, son. And then, you know, Bowser just kind of explodes. And we're fed. The game is complete, at least the first part of it. Anyway, I'm just not gonna bother to 100% it, that's all I meant. I'm sure they'll all be fine. Or he's just like, holy god, you're a lot bigger than I thought. I mean it in a good way, but, uh, whoa! Yes. Uh, okay. Rosalina whispering sweet nothings right into my ear there. Oh. Mario's on board. Super mega nut! Thank you so much for playing my game! Like the red man said, thanks for watching the video. Subscribe for the last time, that's the last time I'm gonna say it in this video. And hey, thanks for sticking around. Mokuraga Nido!